permanent address. Not long ago, we moved to a new home just a short distance from our old one. Despite the close proximity, we still needed to load all of our belongings onto a moving truck because of the timing of the financial transactions. Between the sale and purchase, our furnishings stayed on the truck and our family found temporary lodging. During that time, I was surprised to discover how at home I felt despite the displacement from our physical home, simply because I was with those I love most, my family. For part of his life, David lacked a physical home. He lived life on the run from King Saul. As David was God's appointed successor to the throne, Saul perceived him as a threat and sought to kill him. David fled his home and slept wherever he found shelter. Though he had companions with him, David's most earnest desire was to dwell in the house of the Lord, to enjoy permanent fellowship with him. Jesus is our constant companion, our sense of hope no matter where we are. He is with us in our present troubles and even prepares a place for us to live with him forever. Despite the uncertainty and change we might experience as citizens of this earth, we can dwell permanently in our fellowship with him every day and everywhere. When have you felt most at home in God's presence? How can you know that Jesus is your constant companion and that he is always with you regardless of where you are and you're going through? And what you're going through. Loving God, I thank you for being my permanent address. Help me to recognize you as my most faithful companion who's with me wherever I go. Permanent address. Have a good one, guys.